All right, out the box nation, back again. Uh, I've been gone too long not to give you a new song. Put on your thinking caps. Good content here for you. I know I leave you a little hungry, but I'm gonna have to give you a little feed and you know, put a little nourishment in your brain. Today's content. The holidays are upon us. Out the box nation. I mean, what's going on? The dilemma. What is the true holiday of Christmas about? Is it this uh, be kind to your fellow brother gift giving or the celebration of uh, Jesus Christ's birthday? I mean, um, we've expanded this time of year to all different types of meaning but what does it really mean December 25th you know you can do your research it's a lot of uh, different deities that's uh, assigned to that that date from Dionysus to Nimrod uh, you also have a Horus <laughs> The Egyptian sun god. Then you, know, you got Jesus. So all of them are assigned to December the 25th. So what does it really truly mean? Because, you know, all the symbols that goes along with it. You know, I've did my little research. And um, the Christmas tree, I mean, that was the celebration of Nimrod. Which was the devil before white folks made the devil. You know, the Egyptians had Nimrod and they used to put candles on the tree to celebrate him. So, you know, actually that was worshiping the devil. So I'm like, we 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 picked up bits and pieces of different old religion and we've tied it into one, you know, big, I guess, cesspool of. This is what Christmas is supposed to be. You know, the Santa Claus character, the elves, and I mean, all of these are symbolizing something that's not truly what it's supposed to be. So I'm asking out the box nation, what is this holiday or this time of year? What does it truly symbolizes? Because I've been here a long time and I, I've I've been through a lot of Christmas and it's still the same old tag. I mean, it's a quagmire. I mean, it's, you know, you give a little gift here, okay, then you, you take it back to the store to get your little money. Uh -huh. What is it about? Because if we can't be like this all year round, then it's kind of like it's disingenuous phony, fallacy, a facade, a for show. I'm a realist. I like things to be kept real. Don't wait to one time of the year to be nice and kind to me, and then the rest of the year, you 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 devilish. You know, that, no, you know, that, that won't work either. So, <clears throat> I truly... Am reaching out to all of my out the box nation viewers and those are not. What is this holiday truly about? You know, hit me a link, hit me a comment, and we can chop it up because I truly, like I said, no phoniness. I really want to know what this holiday is truly about because as I looked up all the research on December the 25th. Like I said, it's it's a tie. It, it, it's tied to a, a lot of different deities, not just Jesus. I mean, it's like I said, Dionysus, Horus, Nimrod. It goes on and on. I mean, uh, that date is tied to a lot of different, even um, uh, Krishna. You know, he he's tied to December twenty fifth. So 
you're going to have to give me some clarity or else I will make my own assumption, which I've already have, that, you know, why is this so phony? Why does we have to be uh, phony for this time of the year? Then the rest of the year, we are devilish selves. So, like I said, hit me a link. Hit me a comment. Like a subscribe. Let me know what your really heart is about this holiday spirit. Is it true or is it a fallacy? All right, after Box Nation, be peaceful now.